Hello, hello, welcome back to Rising World. I'm just trying to figure out what I did last time. Uh, I need to make glass, that's what it was. Okay. So, that's all dirt. Where did I put my sand? There it is. So, let's, let's grab three chunks. And I think it's over here. I think. Glass pane. Okay, let's do wind. What do I need for window frames? Uh, mm, yeah, let's do that one. Stop it from turning. So I can get a good look at it. I think I'm going to go with the darker windows. And I need five lumber. Okay. Got 24 there. How many do I need? I need two four, six, probably about eight, I would think. Well, let's do four. See what it looks like. And let's go in our inventory. Let's put it up, put it up there and get rid of that sword. So it'll be on two. Let's run over here and I'm I'm not going to make any fancy frames or anything for this. You know, I'm I'm just not going to do it. So to rotate go there. Whoop. Move it over. Now, page up and page down moves it. Uh, arrows rotate it. Uh, it's been a long time since I've done this. There is a way, okay, shift and no. shift, there we go, All I'm doing is using my sh holding down shift and uh, using my left and right arrow and up and down arrow. So shift. Let's. I'm using my right arrow plus shift to widen it. And I think I've got it in there. To hold it in place, uh, you uh, da, 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 da. just a minute, let me find it. These things are uh, <laughs> okay. Right control. 
Okay. So it's it's going to stay in place until I release it. There's so many different keys that do so many different things. Let's go around here and look at it. Make sure I've got it in place right. Like I say, I could do the window ledges and the frame around it and all that. But yeah, I think so. So I can go right control to release it. Let's put it back. I want it right there. Okay. They should... I think they should all be the same size now. Yeah. And those windows are a little narrower, so I'm going to put in the wide windows first before I change it again. Yeah. So this one should fit in there perfectly. There we go. But the windows by the doors are narrower. So, yeah. Okay. And it's dark, so I'm not saying I'm going to get it perfect. This is our first building. Expect mistakes. All right now, that one's wider than that one. I wonder why. One, two, three blocks. And that one is two blocks, huh? I made a block too, too big. Okay. Let's go get some more blocks. Well, let's get some sleep so we can see what we're doing. And I need some water. So let's get that out of the way. Come on, Betty. Get a drink of water. And what do I got to eat? Let's eat a piece of meat. Let's splurge. There we go. Let's grab some sleep. So it'll be a little bit lighter. I hope everybody is having a good day. I had some extra times this morning so I thought I would get this video out of the way early because I'm getting ready for my check it out Sunday and it's going to be so much fun. I can't wait. Alright. I think it was this one. Let's add an extra few blocks on this side. Let's do it here. Is that the right block? Doesn't look like it. Well, maybe it is. Yeah, I guess it is. Okay. Now let's put our window up. There, now it fits. Okay. Now I need to make my windows narrower.
hope I got these the same size out of windows all right let's go make some more planks and some more uh, I don't think that's the right block sure doesn't look like it does it okay where's my hammer I don't have it with me let's go get it I don't think those are the right blocks Where's my hammer? There it is. Put that there. I'm going to put that there. And I'm going to grab the other blocks. That's 79. And that's 72. Okay. Let's go in the house so we can see. But it's it's coming together. It really is. It's not looking too bad. All right, hammer. Try that one. Yeah, that's it. There we go. That looks a lot better. All right, let's go get some planks and some. Uh, say, okay. that's two. I want to make sure these are the right size since I had trouble with that one too. Two. Two. All right. So I need four more windows. I need some more planks. I am going to put these blocks up. 79. 72. Because these are the outside, that's the roof. Oh, I'm going to need some wood. Let's grab some planks. Or lumber. Do 32 lumber, and then we'll go back down to, construction, that was wood frame D, and let's do four. Hopefully that was the right one. I don't think so. No. All right. I didn't favorite it. It looks dark enough, but... I guess it was that one. And I don't have enough lumber. Let's do three. Put these in the chest. That I will use them on something eventually. And I need a little bit more lumber. I've still got some logs left. I am going to favorite this one this time. 
that is 67. Remember that. Let's do 16. Construction. Wood frame D. 6, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 67. And I don't see a way, to, there's nothing up here to favorite it. So hopefully I've got the right one this time. This makes sure I've got four of them. I think I do. So let's go in and work on the inside. So we go. Look like it was on four. No, it's on three. Inventory. No, it's on five. What's it doing on five? I we've got some apples up there, so nothing else to go in there. All right. Two. Let's turn it around. And it remembers what it was the uh, last size you used. So I want to shrink it, so I'm using my left arrow. And I'm going to use my right control to lock it in place. And it looks like I need to narrow it down just a little bit more, so shift. Okay. And then I am going to move it by using my right arrow to move it. Do I need to bring it up some? I really can't tell with that. Yeah, I need to bring those up. So, this was where the crowbar comes into place. That one looks okay. Yeah, I didn't get any of them high enough. So, let's go back and get my crowbar. That's okay. That gives me a chance to show you how this works. Things like this, <coughs> do not use your hammer. You'll break it. You want to use a crowbar. Come on. Put the crowbar up there. All right. One more time. And we will... I'm going to put... Let's go to the inside when the these uh, new windows first, and then we'll go back and adjust the other ones. But with that scaffolding out here, I can't tell... if I've got it positioned right. It looks like it is. Let's use shift and I'm going to widen it just a hair. Now I'm going to move it over just a hair. And then I am going to move it up just a hair. I think that looks well. I could move it up just a hair. Okay, I'm going to release it, put it back, and you can also do G for a grid if you want to put the grid on the screen and you can see how you, you know, if you want to line something up precisely. And it looks right. So I'm going to go ahead and put it in place. Then we'll go inside and look and make sure. OK. 
Okay. I need to put some steps back here. I do have a couple doors in place, but I don't have them in the front because I'm going to show you how to do it. And then we will take uh, these windows out and reposition them because they're too low. Let's get the crowbar, which is on three. Yeah, now those windows look right. You see the gap in the top? All right. No. No. No, I don't want to hit it. There we go. Right click. Don't left click. Right click. All right. All of these are just a little bit too short. Hold down your right mouse button to use your crowbar and it will take it out and put it back in your inventory. Don't left click because it'll beat it to death. <laughs> like I said, it's been a long time. Long time. That's why one reason I'm I'm showing you how to do it the easy way, but I'm also remembering how for when I get into the more difficult stuff. So, let's go to inventory, find out where, okay, so we're on two, okay. Two. Let's turn it around. Let's go ahead and put the grid up. Why not? It kind of snaps to the grid, which helps. It it helps. All right, let's use shift. Okay. I want to move it over just a hair. No, I don't want to turn it. Sometimes these things will get a little wonky. Okay, that looks good. Let's use the right control to hold it up there. I want to raise it up just a little bit, I think. Or maybe not. Let's take a look at it. Well, it looks like it's in there pretty good. But I am going to raise it just a hair. There we go. That one's in. Then I'm going to have to reposition it. Whoop. I still have my control up. So I have to right control to release it or they'll all sit there. All right. It should be set right now. So let's go ahead and get these in, and then we'll do those two front ones. Once you've got it set, you shouldn't have to change it if you're putting it in exactly the same size opening. And the grid snaps it in place, so that makes it easy. All right. Let's turn it around. Now I am going to shrink it. So I'm going to hold down Shift and my right no. My right mouse button, or my right arrow key. <sighs> okay, shift. Left. Let's get our control the way we want it so we can look at it. I think I want to go just a little bit further in. The height should be right because it was with the other. I just had to uh, widen it. Don't forget to right control to release it. There we go. 
and let's turn our grid off so now our grids off and let's put the doors on I think I've, I've already got them made I think Uh, there they are. Two doors. And I went with these kind just because they kind of fit the building. Alright. You can turn these. I'm going to turn the grid back on. G. That will snap it in place. Now to turn it you just use your mouse button let's put it yeah, let's put it right there and I've got this why isn't it going to fit it fit on the other side <sighs> Man, looks like I'm one block too short over here. Alright, let's go back to our, take the grid off. Uh, crowbar. Come on. Don't hit it. I'm going to have to adjust the front here. I'm going to have to move my windows over one. Huh. Alright. Uh, I don't know if I can take this off with the crowbar. Right mouse button. No, it's not doing anything. So let's try this. I broke it. So all I have is one door, so I will have to make another one. But I didn't check. Over here, I am probably one, two, three, probably five, I would think. So I need to come, let me get a block, blocks are the easiest way to measure. And I am going to need wall blocks, do that, grab some extra, because I'm going to have to take out and put in. I don't want to have to take my window frames out. Because I need to widen this. Alright. Uh, it's on two. Alright. So, I am one, two, three. I think I should be four. One, two, three, four. So, I am going to have to move... This way. Yeah. Okay, I need to move one more this way. So, let's get our crowbar. Take this window out. No, right mouse button, please. All right. Now I need my hammer. Oop. Going to run just a, over just a little bit here. So now let's 
one, two, three. One, two, three. Okay, that's four. So, what I need to do is, what what number's my block on to? Yeah. Let's go ahead and build this back up. Now I need my hammer again. Take that out. All right. Then inventory. What's my window in? Let's put it in four. Put our window back. Turn our grid so it'll snap. There we go. Turn our grid off. Now I should be able to put in the doors. So let's go make another door. And I don't remember what it's going to take. Uh, F. Doors. Wasn't that one. Do I have it under favorites? Let me check. I doubt it. I guess you can't do favorites when you're doing this. And I am I think that's the door I want. Oh, it was this one. Let's go over here and look at it again, make sure. I don't want to get the wrong door. Uh well I've got one in my inventory. What are you doing, Betty? No, I don't have one in my inventory. It's in storage. Let's get that door out and look see which one it is. It's just a single wood door. But it doesn't say what it looks like. So let's get a little bit more sleep and then we'll put these doors on and call it. Come on, don't worry, you could sleep with me. Put this door on, then we can look at it and we can be able to tell which is which. There we go. Like I said, this has been a long time. All right, it's got the, put the grid on. That right there. All right. Yeah, it's got the ring handle. So let's run back over here. F. And that is not the right door. Okay. That is not the right door. So a single door. There it is. Think it's that one? Is it I don't think it had any boards on it. It was just a Yeah. Okay. I want to make sure. I don't want to have to remake it. All right. I think it's this one. And I need 16 lumber. And I've got 12. Resources. Lumber. Doors, single door, craft it. 
and I don't think that's it, but we'll see. Yeah, it is. It is. Okay. All right, let's go grid there. Let's turn it. Right. I need to widen my steps a little bit. F to open. Sometimes there's a way to where you can get these to open the same direction, but I haven't ever been able to figure it out. But anyway, that is the doors and window frames. We will make the glass the next episode and put them in there. Then we will move our crafting stations in. And I will widen this staircase, and I need to put a stairway on the other side, too. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video, mistakes and all. Like I say, this is a learning process. But if you did enjoy the video, please give me a thumbs up. You know, hit that like button. Just don't hurt your finger when you're doing it. Uh, if you want to see more, please subscribe. I'm doing this one, The Infected. I'm doing Eco. I'm doing uh, Spirit of the Island. And I've got a new one coming tomorrow that I am going to showcase on my Check It Out Sunday that I do every Sunday. And it's one I think I'm going to have to add to our daily games. It's one I really, really, really want to get into heavy. Now, I'm not going to tell you what it is because you'll have to watch Check It Out Sunday tomorrow and find out. But anyway, leave me a comment. Any tips, tricks, ideas? Like I say, this basic building. This is something anybody can do starting out. We will be getting into the tough stuff, which I'm dreading because I don't remember much about it. But anyway, have a wonderful day, and I'll catch you in the next one. Goodbye.